That's too high. All right. Hey, I'm Sean. I'm now called. Um, well, it all started at my ninth birthday when I didn't get my pony. It all went downhill from there. Um, I've been sober now for three years. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's enough. That's stopped. Uh, it helps to sh share my story, and this is a place that I can do that. Um, I like to make, make people laugh. I like to, uh, you know, have a good time and whatnot. And um, I have no problems. These lights are bright. I have no problems making people feel uncomfortable. You can ask anybody that knows me. Um, if I go to a, a social gathering or something where, where my people – know me that sean please don't talk so much don't don't stare at anybody for god's sakes don't flirt with your cousin <laughs> were you there because you're laughing <laughs> really hard like we're not related are we <laughs> well if we are there's a chance I went, that was ad libbed, y'all. <laughs> uh, I went to rehab um, once because my practice wife made me. Uh, for y'all that don't know what a practice wife is, it's a nicer way of saying ex wife. Um, I went to go see the doctor when I first got in there, and they asked me all kinds of those questions that y'all, people that went before me, know. And uh, I gave him my answers, and the doctor said, oh, damn, you are effed up. <laughs> and I'm looking at my Medicaid sheet because I'm like, oh, sir, where is that? <laughs> on my list. I don't see med I don't see the F word on here. They put me on Depakote, uh, and it, it turned me into a zombie in the place I work for. They really liked Sean being drugged up because I just, uh, okay. So I was, Sean, go fix that car. Yeah, okay. Sean, go mow the lawn we don't have. Yeah, okay. Go go uh, work for free. What? No. Nah. All right. Uh my boss liked me drugged up so much that he was like, here, here's a bottle of Colazepam to see. I can't read. All right. <laughs> it says it right there, but I don't know it. I don't know it. Take it before every morning before work. Uh, okay. Y'all were supposed to laugh. But that's cool. <laughs> I've been in six accidents, car accidents. Um, all of them drunk. Out of those six, I got four DUIs. The other two, uh, I uh, did what I like to call a DUI avoidance drill. <laughs> uh, on, uh, well, what the, the cops call it, fleeing the scene. <laughs> I, at one point, I got I got pulled my last DUI. I got pulled over for dead tags. All right, I, I wasn't swerving or nothing. I just had dead tags. And the cop asked me if I was if I had been drinking. Uh, well, at the time, I was homeless, living in my car. So I had like fifteen hundred uh, empty bottles and cans, and then I had a forty in my hand, and uh, I said, "Yep." <laughs> Good. We laughed. Uh, after after that DUI, I ended up in jail for for about a year, and um, I just I, it was my twelve month uh, timeout because that was a lot funnier in, in the. <laughs> when I got out of jail, I I got back to work as being a mechanic, and the and the cop that that gave me said DUI, um, I work on his car. <laughs> that's a joke. That's that's. What <laughs> He lets me work on his car. That's crazy. Um, but he's like, he's like, I need you to come for a ride with me. I said, Shh. he said, no, 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 man. I just got a noise in my car. Shotgun. I did. I got to ride up front. That was cool. I was like a little kid. 
Uh, uh, my family all have um, some some mental illness. Obviously, I have more than everyone else. And so yeah, we've got um, ADHD. We got bipolar. We got alcoholism, MS, cancer, everything. We're like the Kmart of uh, mental illnesses. Now, Kmart is 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 like is 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 stupid all right it's like the dollar store it's like the dollar tree of walmart i don't have anything against dollar tree it just was but why do they have why do they have shopping carts there's no reason no reason whatsoever quick question is it is anybody know if it's illegal to put popcorn kernels in a dead man's butt Asking for a friend, I'm just. Okay, what? Now you wonder why people don't give me microphones. Who's that kid? You're grounded. Okay, can you get me? Hey, I need some new, uh, I need a new power wheels. Get your mom to buy you a power wheel. So um, I used to live in this really, really small house. It was, I like to call them a little, little house because uh, a little, 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 it sounds cool. Um, and I was at work and everyone was talking about what the house smells like. Oh, I've got potpourri. I've got, uh, it smells like whatever potpourri smells like. And they asked me, Sean, what does your house smell like? I said, well, mine smells like wood stove and loneliness. Um, no one could find that at Walmart or Kmart or Kmart. Uh, like I said, I was, I was homeless um, for a while. I did live in my 1997 Toyota uh, Avalon. Um, so many memories. But it's really hard to, to, to pick up the ladies. Let me, let me just say, I mean, just, he knows he's been there. He laughed. Because first off, one, you're, you're homeless. So you look homeless. And you smell homeless. And it, they, they just don't want to come back to your car. Because that gets creepy. But I lived in front of Walmart because behind Walmart, them dudes are crazy. Them people are crazy. They are crazy. There's nothing more to other than they just crazy. I have nothing after that. Is they're crazy back people. Mm, they crazy. They crazy. They crazy. So um, I called Canada the other day. It has nothing to do with him. Um, this is another Canadian person that was also as nice because Canada's cool. Uh, didn't have an accent. Kind of like that guy. He kind of has a weird accent. But now this guy didn't have an accent. He kind of sounded like me. Um, they, they, uh, I had to get put on hold for, from the, what was that work? I had to put it on hold and, um, they had good music on, on the hold, like America music and not like, not like Canada music. I don't know if that's proper, but it made me feel like I was in America. So that was, that's pretty good. Thank you. That's all I got.